Good morning. I've got Mojo here making noises at me. Yeah, well, the dogs are just outside barking up a storm. Thanks, buddy. Mojo woke me up this morning, a little brat. Sorry. I wasn't ready to get up yet. And you're just looking for food. You act like you never eat. You've gained weight since you've moved here. <laughs> I'm still here, guys. <laughs> Just can't see me over on the, the animals. I know. Boomer's really mad at me. Boomer has been so bad. He's been getting up on the island in the kitchen and knocking the cat treats off of the island, getting the lid off, and all the animals have been having a heyday with the cat treats. Yep. Just like uh, Finnegan does at Carla and Dennis's house. Well, I I yelled at him, and he hasn't been around since I yelled at him. So I try and color. He walks all over my color and stuff, and lays down on my book. Uh huh. <laughs> well, you see what it's like me trying to edit. He just. He does everything he can to stop you from doing whatever you're doing. So it's pay so attention to him. bad. Now, Mojo, you can do anything as long as you're just scratching. Just absently scratching. Yeah, he comes and lays down, or she comes and lays down by me a lot. and She's not an issue. But Mojo will walk all over the tables and spill stuff, knock stuff all over. But he's not graceful. Who, Mojo or Boomer? Boomer. Yeah. No, he's not. Boomer is definitely not graceful. <laughs> Come on. Did you find anything? Look in the mouth. Look in the mouth. <laughs> she thinks it's a game. <laughs> well, you're the one who started it. <laughs> So, Lay down, you silly dog. Well, I'm going to be in the garage again, finally working on the, the drawers. I have, um, I have to go get hinges. And I, I figure I'm going to have to get them today. Are you trying to hinge me? Are you saying I'm unhinged? <laughs> no comment. So, but the hinges are all the way up in Ontario. And so I may have to do the drive because they may, uh, the stores may not be open tomorrow on Sunday. I'll have to check the hours. I, initially, I was going to just put the drawers in to his kitchen and then grab a door and go to the store. But I realized that it's going to be Sunday when I do that. And I don't know if Rockler's going to be open. And Home Depot doesn't carry the hinges. So... Are we not paying enough attention to you? Of course not. So. Yeah, I, I'm just gonna sleep again. I'm. I still feel exhausted. <laughs> Open your mouth. You got. The dog will climb right in if you do that. <laughs> Thank you for speaking on me. Okay, it's another beautiful day in the neighborhood. Pretty warm here. Sorry to all of you suffering out there on the east coast and uh, the uh, southeast. It is a beautiful day here. Great day to be in my garage building cabinet drawers. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I've got my plywood. I've got my cut list. Now I just need to start uh, ripping this plywood down and uh, then I can start making my uh, drawers. Now I have to do a dado cut and I will be doing that on the table saw. 
and this takes a little bit of setup because my table saw is old and my blade does not go all the way down into the table so I actually have to put a um, uh, a table a half inch table on top of this to uh, get a correct height so getting the correct height is vitally important make sure that our dado isn't too deep or too shallow so that I can get my bottom to fit in perfectly another eighth of an inch about the width of the blade itself so I can get my quarter inch groove all the way across. I may have to do a third run because there's going to be a little bit in the middle. I'd rather do that with a table saw than try to get it out with a chisel. Alright, so I got all the drawer sides cut, and I've got the dado in all of them. Uh, next step is going to cut my bottom, and I am using melamine. This is a medium density fiberboard MDF with a melamine uh, coat. That makes it a little easier to clean up. Um, I am, since it's dadoing in, I don't have to worry about gluing it in, and it shouldn't glue in anyway. Gives the drawer uh, opportunity to breathe, because drawers do. Wood does breathe. If it, when it, um, depending on the moisture. So, since I got a quarter inch dado and a half inch piece of wood, um, the bottom is needs to be cut a half an inch smaller than the drawer dimensions. And I'm gonna, I'm going to cut it even a, about a sixteenth of an inch less than that, just to make sure it's going to uh, have enough room to, to wiggle room. Um, I will cut. I have, all my drawers are 19 inches deep, so my first cut is going to be 18 and a half, a little less. So, and I might be able to get all four out of that one cut. Cuts are done. Here they all are. Now I just need to glue them and staple them all together. are done. The last thing I need to do is attach the, the slides. I'm using the old slides. They are in good shape. The faces, I will sand down some holes that I filled and I will be attaching the faces over there while I'm uh, doing installing all this stuff.
All right, drawers are all done. They've got their hardware on and uh, sanded down a bit. I haven't sanded everything down. Got some dirt spots, but I will bring my sanders with me. Uh, I have to uh, get up early tomorrow, pick Megan up in Temecula and take her to Rancho Cucamonga. So that ought to be interesting. But, and uh, my job is close to there, so hopefully uh, there won't be a lot of lag time for me getting there. So. All right, so that's it for today. Uh, I'm afraid Val is out for the count right now, so I'm not going to wake her up, and uh, Angel could just wait till tomorrow to do her thing. So um, tomorrow I need to get up early and pick up uh, Megan, and then I have to go install these drawers. See how if they'll let me uh, videotape that. That would be interesting. Um, I discovered that the that Rockler has hours tomorrow, so I will be able to get the uh, the hinges. I'll have to take a door, take the Rockler with me. So that'll be um, a full day tomorrow. So um, I hope you like something in this video. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to. Uh, uh, tell all your friends and absolutely don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys tomorrow but well, she please is. subscribe wow she's away please subscribe is that but, it? I just see a hand but <laughs> most of all <laughs> See you tomorrow.